Hello Internet, welcome to Calculator Learning Tutorials. Uh, in this quick tutorial, I'll be showing how to do integration calculations on Casio FX991ES. Now this is one of the most sought out uh, tutorials. Uh, I've been asked a lot to do this tutorial, so uh, here I am presenting how to do that. Uh, before we perform integration calculations on calculator it is recommended that you shift the mode to math for that you can go to shift then press mode then select one alright by doing that uh, if you click on the integration sign it will show you uh, show you in a format where you can enter the function and the limits directly so which is very convenient so that is why I recommend using integration in maths mode so let us perform first operation let us say we want to find integration of natural log of x and the range is 1 to e so this thing this problem is equivalent to this so how how can we do that we can simply enter uh, the function and then you can press the down arrow it will prompt you to enter the lower limit which in our case is 1 then press the up arrow key it will prompt you to enter the upper limit and in our case the upper limit is E so you can input that by pressing alpha and then this key and then equals and the answer is 1 uh, if you are not in the maths mode even then you can do uh, integration but for that you would need to follow this format this format says you, you would need to enter the function then the lower limit then the higher limit and then tolerance so tolerance is something which is optional you if you want to put tolerance you can enter that but even if you do not put in a value for tolerance it will take up the default value now let's perform another operation I'll clear this then you can press integral sign now the function is 1 divided by uh, x square and the lower limit is 1 the upper limit is 5 and the answer is 4 by 5 now I'll show you how to do this in normal linear mode okay now uh, I am in the default mode of calculator if you press an in integral button here it will prompt you to enter the function first we can enter the function as usual and then put a comma for comma you need to use this button whose alternate function by shift is comma then enter the lower limit which is 1 then put a comma again then put the higher limit which is E and then close the brackets
So the answer again is 1. So you can use both math and linear mode to calculate integrations and it will give you the final result after performing uh, the integration of a function and putting the upper and lower limits. I hope this tutorial was helpful and thank you so much for watching this tutorial and you have a very good day. Bye bye.